Alright, that's small ones. Need three of those. Alright, just finish you all. Are you goddamn serious? Take this. That's big ones. Okay, oh, uh, no, no. Boost. Good lord. Need that. There. Light. Light you. Get back. Got him. All right, all three. We're good. I'm running ass. I'm hauling ass. Uh, I hope I got the right ones. Unless I got the one that can kill him. But I, I presume they kill me, not him. We'll, we'll find out soon enough. Let's go with that. Oh, got this. Jump here. Just run. We're running. Now, all I gotta do is quick travel there. Well, no. Not close enough. I could go there, actually. That's not bad. That second apartment. There's a bunch of shit here. You know, I'm just gonna sleep. I need some health. I got it. Oh, hell, it's just right there. Alright, now I just gotta find this one hidden book somewhere in this big ass place. It's not gonna be in the first room. That's pretty much a guarantee. Look for a bookshelf. Or right here. Come on, that's a book. There's the book. I see you. Uh, fairy tales. That's interesting. Man, I got a bunch of shit to turn in. Right. And it's not a hard run over there either. And I'll see you over there. Unfortunately, I was hoping to do some zombie killing to get some rarer stuff. Eh, not this mission. Or recording. And this is what I kind of planned on. Get some rare ones. They always have like a goon or something for you. Is that Renegades? There you go. I helped. That counts. You like you uh, you liked it. You liked me more. Forget about the whole genocide thing earlier. That you definitely don't know about. There's so many markers here. How's the patient? He's starting to wake up. So I Thank gave him the right flowers? For your help. You can go. Wait, what's going on here? You went to the witch, didn't you? To this Margaret. Many witches. I heard from her. I mean, hurt his reputation. She gave me herbs that might help him. She's not a witch. There's no such thing as witches. 
That's superstition. Superstition? Witchcraft is a crime! Please, just calm down. What's happening? We're losing him. Aiden, give me those herbs. I forbid it! Keep that witch's poison away from him! I can him. give him an injection to stabilize him. But it won't last long. Did you tell her who the medicine was for? She killed his men! She should have had him for that, but Jack Mac had ate or burn her eyes out instead! What? Did you tell her? She'll have given you poison, I guarantee it! Aiden, give me the herbs, damn it! Oh shit! Small petals, big petals. Wait, I, I need to check with somebody. Make it fast. So it'll probably give them big ones. Hey, Luan, you there? Aiden? What's going on? Do you know anything about recluse petals? Petals? There was something. Wait. Frank told me once. Some were medicinal. Which ones? The small ones. The small. The, the small ones heal. That's what I remember. Okay. So I was afraid someone might she, have misled me. Aiden, she owed me. What's going on? I'll tell you later. Sorry. So, what are we going to do? Small petals. This could go south bad. <sighs> How is he? It appears the medicine is as effective as I'd hoped. Is he about going to suddenly die? He needs his rest. We should all leave him be. Oh my god, I thought I killed him. <laughs> I, I won't be far. Damn. She, bitch owed me, but hated him. It looks like you had Margaret pegged. She didn't want to poison him after all. Yes, seems that way. And what'll happen to him now? If all goes well, he should start to wake up soon. And then we'll find out who did this to him. All thanks to you. Well, technically, I didn't do that to him. That was Waltz. Rage booster, 100 money. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, nothing to loot. So the next thing. Matt? What's up? I wanted to officially thank you. Ace us back on his feet. If it wasn't for you, he'd still be in a coma. Or worse. I'm glad he's better. Me too. Oh. Well, that just ended that conversation. 42. No, I, I need this. I need a better bow. Yes. This could bite me in the ass, but if I saved his life, I bet I might be safe. Two. So it's, ooh, that's big damage increase. Now I can sell that bow. And soon, thanks to you, I'll know as well. Over and out. Okay. Well, I'm uh, I'm hoping he's a man of his word. We did work together to get Waltz. Sort of. Failed. And there's no fucking jumping. One. Here's Curia missions. Is that... Is that the Master Sword? Stop swinging. I want that. I have a letter for you. Finally. I'm sorry, sir. I brought the letter as soon as it was given to me. I'm not upset with you. It's my son. Weeks without hearing from him. Thought he was dead. No concern for his father. I'm thankful for you, Carrier. At least now I know my idiot son is still alive. Well, from the point of him writing that letter, I wouldn't guarantee it right this very second. Nope, that's not it. Another guy. Oh, no, a kid. Hello. I'm from the Carrier's Guild. I have a letter for Barry. Mom? Mommy! It's a letter from Dad! Careful. Don't tear the letter when you open it. I won't, Mom. I swear. 
bless you, Carrier. You made my son's day. Cool. No tip? Bitch. Hey, Driscoll. Job done. All packages delivered safely. Well, that's what I want to hear. Come by when you can. I've got something for you. Remember, you can always take the metro to get here quicker. Jack Matt deals with these damn renegades. Yeah, it's a quick travel. I could probably... Seriously? Did someone bump that thing? Talk to Juan. Is Ader up to talk to? No, book club. Alright, library dude. I got some good literature for you. Your books. Not my books, dear boy. Our books. Humanity's books. Well, one's a fairy tale, and one's a Bible. Sighing right now, due to uh, your ladders debatable. And it doesn't even know why. This tale, your tale, will be the next great epic, and it's only begun. Ah, the Bible. I mean, well, that's like the book, right? Few books have shaped the world as profoundly as the Bible. Oh. Get them to worship Hans me. Christian Anderson and his fairy tales. Powerful stories of virtue and resilience. Children's tales, yes, but containing wisdom for all. You have just rescued the collective unconscious of the Western world. Thanks to you, the fire in the belly of humanity burns brighter today. Let's stoke it more, shall we? Thalia there is my associate. She helps me track the collections around the city. She will point you to the next locations as I catalog the books you bring me. How about tell me all of them? Then I occasionally drop them off for money. Oh, you. Hi, Aiden. I'm Thalia. So, you're the pilgrim Albert told me is helping us rebuild humanity's library. I am. Yeah, basically. Albert's a wonderful man. I only hope others will appreciate what he's trying to do. We're not in the middle of the Renaissance, you know. Few people read. What about you? Probably fewer well, know how to. Do you read? <laughs> eh. When I can. Not often. Then tell me what you think. Between the Bible and Hans Christian Andersen's fairy tales, which would you consider a better guide to human behavior? I'm going to go with the Bible. Actually, both. Hmm. Well, if I had to pick one. Um, the Bible, I guess. Isn't it the word of God? Hmm. Wouldn't you have to believe in God for that to be true? And a particular version of God at that. I must speak to Albert now. Perhaps we'll talk again. Speaking of which, here are the locations of more books. Okay. Now it's time to Juan's party. PK stuff. I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he is a snack, isn't he, dear? I'll probably Can take her, it? not you. More the merrier. No, thank you. Oh, if I embarrassed you, I'm sorry. I do have that effect on people. I'll wait for you, but make it quick. I must admit, I admire your persistence. Almost curious what you do after I send you packing, yet again. You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Modeled a year before the pandemic broke out. I 
I've read that one barrel of this stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. Ah, what a sublime present. You interested now? I have extra. Why not? To your help, handsome. He wants to fuck me. What can I say? You broke down my defenses. So, you're still after those lamps. Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? And why he really wanted them? Yeah, to take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? Nobody tried that for over a decade. Mm, was it dangerous? So I guess it's dangerous. That's what the lamps are for. It's a bunch of infected. But lamps need electricity to run. The last I heard, the juice ain't flowing there. People have tried to take it without power. Heroes and fools alike. All ended up as volatile snacks. I mean, that's Matt's problem. What do you care? I care because something's not right. Can't you sense that as well, Aiden? Uh, slightly. I mean, if they can push in far enough with like generators and lights, you can maybe push the uh, infected out. Matt wants to prepare to defend the city from the butcher's coming attack. So we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center, while the colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever, and half the city will find itself under toxic water. The colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. Hmm. So why did the butcher attack the canteen? That's Me? in the city center. Good question. Maybe. It wasn't the colonel who gave the order. Something more is going on. It's something we don't yet understand. What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. Why would Jack skim UV lamps? And here, friend, the mystery takes flight. Jack never Secret got operation? over the fact that he didn't defeat the butcher back when he had the chance, years ago. He knew that if he attacked the dam, the colonel would close the floodgates. And the rising water levels would push the chemicals up out of the ground, burning through everything that lives in the city. And it's been a stalemate for over ten years, each waiting for the other to make a move. But then, someone turned the power on and something changed. And the renegades attacked the canteen. Hmm. I'm not here for my health, Juan. I need the lamps to- To find out what happened to your sister. Right, Aiden? I told you I got my spies. Might be able to find something out about Waltz and your sister. Specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources, I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. You can help. Oof. Mmm. Yeah, I'll stick with Matt. You're not using me to make a move of your own. I'm not your enemy, Aiden. It's a shame you don't see that. You'll get your lamps. You just gotta talk to Demolan. Who's he? He's my man. Sent him out to search for more lamps, but he hasn't checked in for a while. Where can I find him? Around here. Last I heard from him. Find him. Then come back to me here afterward. Got it. Company, but I'll need you to go now. 
I mean, I, I like her company a little bit more. A bunch of pain in the ass. Parkour point? Actually, while well, I'm... Got it. I mean, that may be very useful. Alright, so I can just land safely. I, I love that. More books, and he's there. Actually, I could... Go... Boom, boom. What the fuck's up here again? I could... No, no. Maybe I gotta leave first. Okay. Got a ra ranged weapon. I got that. Alright. What's, uh... Let's go back to this. Can I fast travel now? Well, guess not. Or I could just go right here, actually. So he's probably. Oh, I hear a big boy somewhere. Hey, is anyone there? Actually, I will go to this. Does that work? Yep, I got you. Ow! Son of a whore. Okay, hold on. Where's the fire arrows? A shock. Got 50 of those fuckers. There, you're dead. I mean, he's definitely down there. Death from above, was it? Range weapon? Oh, gotcha. I don't like this. Hmm. And you're dead now? Seriously, I could still pick that up. He's obviously in there. Seriously, did not hear him. Well, I guess it's the first counter for a berserker, but I have killed one earlier. Oop, there we go. Dude, you yeah, just keep running into him. That is awesome. I can stop you. Look how, how con you are. Oh, that's not good. Something's blowing. Ow, that hurt. Oh, no, 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 no. I did not dodge you right. right I'm just going to go up here. There you go. There. You're dead. Or well, you're dying. There. That, nope, that's not it. Burn it now. I just, just gotta run. That hurt. That really hurt. I, I need some help. You know, immediately. There you go. Now burn a bit. I mean, 
All you guys are basically dead now. And I can take all this stuff now. A bit of a waste. Definitely unique. I'll loot all this real quick. And uh, it's everyone. And I do love uh well, let me let me in, damn it. Yeah, I love my fire arrows. Good job, man. You showed him. You're a goddamn superhero. Damn straight. That beast had us trapped here. Wouldn't go away. It attacked us right as we got here. Mark got hurt pretty bad. We barely escaped and huddled up here. Finally went quiet not long ago. We thought that thing had wandered off. Next thing we hear is you banging on our barricade and then it all started again. I'm looking for Demolin. You guys seen him? Up top. Cool. Uh, come on. Let's get you to a doctor. Thanks, man. Uh, is it up top? Where Where am I going here? Is it outside up top? Oh. There's a door here. I'm a fucking idiot. You're Demolin, right? I'm Aiden. Not bad. Not bad. Aiden? Nice to meet you. Your skills are exceptional. And you don't look like a peacekeeper to me. So who are you? Ah, uh, that's about the lamps. Ask more about yourself. Hmm. I'm a pilgrim. I haven't been here long. A pilgrim? Did you travel far to reach the city? Quite a long way, yes. Why? Have you been to Marseille by any chance? I'm sorry. I never heard of the place. My hometown. I wonder what's become of it. Hmm. Juan told me to check up on you and the lamps. Ah, the lamps. Piece of cake, he says. Huh. No such luck. We found a few, but it wasn't what you would call a bountiful harvest. And it came at great cost. The corporal killed by the beast outside has a brother in the unit. He will be devastated. He is at present with a squad down south on the lower dam promenade. They have not reported in. That doesn't sound good. We need to find him. The boy's mother lost her husband in a dark zone just last week. Now, a son. If her other son were to perish, it would be too much for any mother to bear. I'll try to find him. Okay. The boy's name is Sebastian. The islands are a dangerous area. Worse since the renegades overran them. Okay. So we got, uh... That's just blocked off. Can't really do anything up here, right? No. Of course. Now, uh... We just head outside and see what we do out here. Good little loot there. That's nice. Something in here. What is this? It's a lost sector, isn't it? Yes, it is. All right, actually, I'm going to head over here first. Actually, the fast travel was actually on the map. I was looking off to the side. Hey, how you doing there? Oh, great. Supply are quite a helpless bunch, it seems. What did you expect? There were ordinary people before the fall. Craftsmen, teachers, gardeners, not fighters. Alright. You do that. I'm gonna talk to the courier. Maybe he knows more about my sister. Oh, that is so much easier. I'll take that and well, I'm sorry, buddy. All right, what else do you got for me? Ooh. Tape. Good work, hotshot. What did you think? All sorts of letters and recipients out there. It's the network, like I said. You just helped expand it. Looks like your carrier material after all. Are you ready and willing to take the oath? Uh, really? Uh, pilgrims aren't that formal. Uh... Maybe that's part of your problem, hotshot. 
If you want this, then you'll repeat after me. Fine, let's do this. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. I, initiate of the Carrier's Guild. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. Swear to serve all the citizens of the city equally. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. To face any dangers and safely deliver all mail entrusted to me. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. I will do so with the utmost honor and integrity in accordance with the standards of the Carrier's Guild. By the power granted me by the Carrier's Guild, I hereby proclaim you a full member. Initiate rank. Welcome to the fold, hotshot. I let me know when Is there something special? Fuck it, I'm right here. Give me something. Ooh, trade. What do you have? Oh, you got some lock picks, low level shit though. I can sell some of that. I'm ready, Driscoll. Got an assignment for me? Well, I do. But first, let me lay some carrier history on you. Okay. I'm a bit of a history buff, like. Did you know that the first documented postal system was in Egypt? Around 2400 BC? I did not. Aye. It's how the pharaohs sent out decrees. Creating... The network. Think of the ancient nice. tradition you're upholding just by delivering a piece of mail. I will. I, I promise. See that you do, hotshot. Now deliver this message. It's marked urgent. So I'm only sending you out with this one. Now don't get distracted. It'll get where it needs to go. Uh, in two weeks from now. Okay. Well, I have just became a mailman, a glorified mailman. I feel honored. I shall be the greatest among all mailmen. And I'll eventually become a postal man. Oh, look, it's a baby carrier. Then go postal. So much for this being an elite group. Pilgrim? Fuck that shit. Now what's your problem? You better not become my problem. For all we know, you could be the next Derek waiting to happen. The next who? What the hell are you talking about? Never you mind, baby carrier. Just keep your nose clean around here. And I'll be watching you. Great. You can watch me flip you the bird. Oh, great. Baby carrier's a comedian, too. Well, I humor myself. Is going to shit. Coming from you, I guess I'm just upholding your legacy. That's just Jack. Ignore him, compañero. It doesn't look like he's gonna let me ignore him. Tranquilo. His bark is worse than his, uh, chew? No. Is that the word? Bite. Me amo Jaime, by the way. Being a carrier is dangerous. We're a small group, and we rely on each other. So, you're a pilgrim. Good. You've seen and done things. Sometimes, those novatos get people killed. Aiden, did this Derek get someone killed? Luckily, no. Derek was just plain loco, an adrenaline junkie. We all take this seriously, but he was obsessed. In a way, you had to admire his dedication, even if he was fanatical. So what happened? Left the other carriers with tough deliveries in the lurch. What became of him? Booted out on his ass. No room for a Scarface in the Carrier's Guild, amigo. Recipe for death and disaster. Let me guess. Jack led the campaign against Derek. And he was very effective, amigo. I'm sure he was. Okay. Uh, hopefully that was a save. <laughs>